Let's take a look at another example. The U.S. Department of Transportation reported that in a recent year, AirTran led the nation in the fewest occurrences of mishandled baggage, with a mean rate of 1.31 mishandled bags per 1,000 customers. Assume mishandled baggage occurrences are Poisson distributed. What is the average number of passengers between occurrences? Okay. So let's take a look at this. Um, we've got a random variable y, and that is a continuous random variable that we want to measure the time between occurrences. Okay, so the time, or pardon me, this is the passengers between occurrences. Passengers between mishandled bags. Okay. Uh, so we're here, we're saying that mishandled bags are the occurrences and uh, passengers are, is the interval, okay? So naturally, we can't have 2.7 passengers, but relative to the number of bags, this, is gonna, this interval is going to be pretty large. And in fact, we said that lambda was uh, 1.31 mishandled bags per 1,000 passengers. Okay, so let's just assume that we could describe passengers on a continuous number line, and we could describe passengers with an exponential distribution. Okay, a again, these really are discrete numbers. We can't have 973.2 passengers, but for our purposes, let's treat this as a continuous random variable. Okay, so what is the average number of passengers between occurrences? Well, this is occurrences per passengers, and one over that would give us the number of passengers uh, between occurrences, okay? That would be 763.4 passengers, okay? So the interval, the average interval between mishandled bags, 763.4 passengers. Okay, now let's take a look at some probability problems. What's the probability that at least 500 passengers will have their baggage handled properly before the next mishandling. Okay, what's the probability that at least 500 passengers will have their baggage handled properly before the next mishandling? That says that what's the probability that there's not a mishandled bag in the first 500 passengers? That we have to wait until after 500 passengers to see a mishandled bag. Okay, well, let's draw a picture of that. Here, we have random variable y. That's the number of passengers between mishandled bags. And we're saying that we don't see one. We don't see a mishandled bag in the first 500 passengers. We only see it sometime afterward. Okay? So this is our PDF. And we want this area. Okay? That's the probability that Y takes on a value greater than 500. Okay? So we could do this. We could say, uh, we could take the integral between 500 and infinity of our PDF, which is lambda 1.31 over 1,000, uh, e to the minus 1.31 over 1,000, y dy. Okay? This, uh, we, we can do this. This is really not all that difficult to do, but this is also equivalent to the complement of this probability. And that's the cumulative probability evaluated at 500. Okay? And that would be 1 minus uh, e to the minus 1.31 over 1,000 times 500. Okay? Here the ones go away. This is just e to the minus 1.31 over 1,000 times 500. And if we work that out, that is 0.5194. Okay, so what does that say? That says that we have to see at least 500 passengers before our next mishandled bag with probability 0.5194. That is uh, roughly 50% of our bags uh, are not mishandled in the first 500 passengers. Okay. Let's take a look at another example. What's the probability that the number of um, of passengers will be fewer than 200. Okay, so what's the probability that y is fewer than 200? 
until we see the next mishandled bag. Okay. So here we have our distribution again. Here's y, here's f of y, here's 200, and we want this probability. That is, what's the probability that it takes fewer than 200 passengers coming in for us to see our next mishandled bag? Okay. Well, this is the cumulative probability evaluated at 200. The probability that y is less than 200 is equal to the cumulative probabil probability evaluated at 200. Okay. That's the probability between 0 and 200. Okay. That's just 1 minus e to the minus 1.31 divided by 1,000, evaluated at 200, okay? And if we work that out, we should get 0 0.2305. The probability that we'll see a uh, mishandled bag in a s interval of 200 passengers or less, 0 0.2305.